Manners maketh man. Kingsman The Secret Service. This movie is directed by the same guy who made X-Men First Class, the same guy involved in Kick-Ass, Matthew Vaughn. And this movie is about a group of agents called Kingsmen who go out into the world and kill certain people with style. And one of the experienced agents played by Colin Firth meets this youth played by Taron Egerton. Firth introduces him to Kingsman, so he gets training to become one of them, and the goal is to stop a main villain played by Samuel Jackson. Guys, think of Kick-Ass and a James Bond film. You put them together and you got this movie. But the question is, will it work? Is it a good film? Hell no. This is not a good film. It is awesome. This film was able to do things that other films that came out this year failed to do. It knows what it's doing, and Matthew Vaughn knows how it needs to be done. And this guy makes you want to smile. All the characters in this film did wonderful. You got the main lead, the teen. He starts as a nobody, and as the film progresses, he just builds up, and now he's an ultimate badass. This kid has a great sense of humor, and you will laugh to some of the things that he's saying. Which brings me to Samuel Jackson. He was great as well, playing this over-the-top villain who talks a lot of shit throughout the film. Every time you see this guy on screen, you just smile, and he pulled it off, and he is the funniest person in the entire movie, and he has this female amplity henchman with blades below her legs, and this woman is just badass, slicing everyone with those blades, running all over the place, and tearing everyone from limb to limb. But the man which I was really impressed with is Colin Firth. I mean, this guy, this man is a legend. He did spectacular, and both him and Taron Egerton have a pretty good relationship in this one. You love the things that he says, and you stay connected to this character. And when he goes out killing guys, being a badass, it is splendid. And you believe that he is on screen kicking ass. By the way, the action scenes, the shaky cam, is awesome. Whoa, did I just say that shaky cam is awesome? Isn't that supposed to be bad? The thing that I'm trying to say is that the style of the action scenes is very unique. For example, there were a couple of scenes where Colin Firth is fighting, and the camera literally had these long takes of the main character. The camera zooms to him, then it zooms to a guy getting stabbed by a knife. Then it zooms to him back. Then it zooms to another guy getting shot in the head. Then it zooms back to him. This film is extremely violent. Just like Kick-Ass. And there was this one scene where things just get over the top of the violence. And so much innocent civilians were being slaughtered. And holy shit. I mean, wow. This year, we have Mordecai, which is a spy thriller. And Taken 3, which is an action film. Both films fail to please us. Taken 3 is a film that has too much painful jump cuts and action scenes, and Mordecai was just an unfunny, boring film. Look what I said in that review. If only I had a time machine to go forward into the future, I would have gone and see Kingsman The Secret Service. <sighs> I need a break. Well, there you go. And look what happened. I enjoyed myself. Kingsman was able to avoid those mistakes with the humor and the fluent and smooth action scenes. This film is a miracle. In my Fifty Shades of Grey review, I said, if you are a fan of the book, then go see it. Fuck that shit. Go and see this one instead. It's fun, it's not predictable, it's funny. A good film for the Valentine's weekend. By the way, the main villain in the film is named Valentine, so there are some references. I want this film to be a franchise now! 9 out of 10 suits for Kingsman The Secret Service. 
Some minor problems though, there were a few times when things were dragging on and there were a couple of dumb moments, but other than that, you are worthy to watch this film. So yeah, that is my take of Kingsman The Secret Service, thank you for watching, more views on the way.